So this is quite possibly the biggest lobster that we have ever caught, and the only reason we were able to catch it is because he has small claws. At some point in his life, he lost his claws, and he grew back some new ones. So unfortunately, his claws don't match his body, but if you look at his body, it's very impressive. This lobster's gotta be around 100 years old, and I've said this on the page before, but it's pretty crazy to think about it. My father has very likely caught this lobster at one point in his life, so is my grandfather and possibly my great-grandfather has also caught it. If you want to get crazy, it's possible that my great-great-grandfather caught that lobster when it was a baby. They've all fished the same area for years. These lobsters kind of migrate through the same areas year after year, and a lot of people didn't really understand it when I mentioned it in the past. They say, how could my great-grandfather have caught it? It would have been legal size. But 90 years ago, when he was young, this would have been undersized. This lobster would have been oversized around 50 years ago.